How to use Canva with Printify. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an absolutely incredible and amazing day. I bring you back with yet another video and in this video we're going to be talking in great depth and detail about Printify and how you're going to use it with Canva and how we're going to use both of these softwares all together to you know get the best outcome out of uh, all the things we have going on for ourselves okay so it's going to be a really helpful and a really fun video it's going to be really informational so please do make sure to watch this video till the end to gain all the information and to gain all the data that you can about this video so yeah but without further ado let's just get straight into the details in that so uh basically first of all what we are going to be doing is obviously we're going to be open canva.com in one tab and printify in the other tab so here's printify you know printify drop shipping and printing service for e-commerce so let's go ahead and load this up here we go create and sell custom products 100 percent free to use 800 plus high quality products largest global print network and start for free how it works etc etc you also have higher profits we offer some of the lowest prices in the industry because print providers continuously complete to win your business robust scaling you know easily handle peak holiday seasons with their wide network of partners and automatic routing functionality and then finally best selection with 800 plus products and top quality brands you can choose the best products for your business then also finally you have you know you easily add your design to a wide range of products it could be you know your custom products like shirts and stuff it could be tags it could be you know cups and all that so pretty basic stuff and as you can see connect your store to all these and obviously we're going to connect it to shopify over here aren't we so we're not going to connect it up from here though like you can also connect it to canva but obviously as i told you we're not going to connect it from here uh, i'm just going to open and once we keep it open we're going to come back to shopify and over here you're going to go ahead and write t-shirt okay and once you write t-shirt this will start giving us different t-shirt designs wait not christian t-shirt i just want a t-shirt there we go so now it will start giving us different t-shirt designs for our you know shirt now obviously most of these designs are going to be uh, either for the pro plan or they're going to be paid and stuff so just switch this to free and this will start giving you the free designs and as you can see pretty good and pretty nice looking free designs over here so let's say i am going to go with yeah i'd say let's go with the uh, yeah this one this one looks pretty nice you know looks pretty simple and abstract and i just like to keep it simple i don't want to go too big with the design and stuff so we're gonna go on this okay and once you've chosen the design now you're gonna actually think of the niche and uh, think of the target audience that you are going to be targeting on your printify okay because obviously every different uh, age group has different tastes in shirts not everyone likes funky text on their shirts not everyone likes nothing on their shirt you know different types of people different age groups of people like different types of things so obviously it is your job to know the niche and once you know the proper niche you can start actually adding your design now obviously this is a template that we picked off so you can either keep it this way or you can start adding your own design okay and adding your own design is pretty simple and easy okay because uh that basically gives you the freedom of doing anything and everything so obviously you can take this one you can take inspiration from these but in this case i'm gonna remove that okay and let's choose a good shirt color let's say i'm gonna go with dark blue now we're gonna go ahead and add some text okay now uh, i'm just gonna add this and we're gonna go in fonts and uh, let's start finding some good fonts for ourselves okay so we have let's go with um, we have tons and tons of fonts here but you know it's typical to find a good one so this one looks pretty retro looks pretty you know in date so i'm gonna go and write let's say i'm gonna write summer vibes okay and once you write that uh we're gonna keep that i'm gonna keep this a bit up here okay and down here you can add some you know different elements like some sun or something like that uh let's say i'm gonna add some you know dragon or some sun you know you get the whole point well let's say i'm gonna add this over here 
as so. And then I'm gonna also gonna take a sun. There we go. Make sure not to take a very cartoonish sun or something like that. Yeah, you know what? The sun looks too cartoonish, so I'm gonna not add that. Keep this in it. Summer wives, I'm gonna take this a bit up, take this over here. You can obviously add more uh, designs. Like, let's say I'm gonna add cloud. And uh, let's go with this one. Let's say this dragon is actually coming out of the cloud. We're gonna choose a color for the cloud, obviously, a color that matches well with our design. And uh, now you're actually gonna wanna go with a basic. So, as you can see, I'm gonna do that. And you know, in the blue, you're going to make sure to, you know, give it a bit of a contrast worthy design or, you know, just keep it white, or blue, you know, whatever suits you best. And the gray down there obviously gives it its nice shadow. Uh, and then you could also add the same cloud on its, uh, you know, uh, feet over here because obviously dragons, we all know that dragons don't fly. They use clouds to boost them up in the air. That is a fact. So let's add this. And uh, obviously, there's one hand over there as well. So I'm going to add one more. I'm going to do this. Once you do that, you're going to keep this over here as well. And uh, yeah, there we go. So obviously, once you do that, here you can see you have your design, Summer Wipes. So once you've got your design, you're going to click on Share and you're going to click on Download. And once you click on Download, you're going to download it as PNG. Okay. And once we download it as PNG, there we go, it's here. And now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over to your main Printify. Uh, and in your Printify, you're just gonna go obviously into start for free and everything, you're gonna register. And once you register, you are gonna make sure to go ahead. And once you're signing up and everything, you're gonna go into the editorial section on the gallery wraps that Printify actually brings you. And in the gallery wraps, obviously, it's going to give you the option of implementing your design onto the shirt like this, you know, So take your design, implement it onto the shirt and do not forget to remove the background. OK, you're going to remove the background from remove.bg. Obviously, we only want summer vibes, this white dragon and these clouds. OK, we don't want the whole blue background. The only reason I kept the blue background was so that we have a strong color for it to, you know, catch and remove. So as you can see, we have that. And there we go. Then we have that. So pretty great stuff. So I'm going to download it and let me show you how it's going to look like. So that's what it's going to look like on the shirt that we're going to implement on Printify. So pretty great and easy stuff to get your head behind. So I hope this tutorial was extremely helpful to you. And uh, if you need any more videos like this, please do tell me I am always available and I will give you the easiest step to step guides for any type of videos that you demand. And uh, I hope you all have a great day. So until next time, I'll see you later and goodbye.